LSU entered game three knowing they were going to have to battle to take the series over Texas A&M and they did just that and what was a frustrating game coaches arguing with the home plate umpire over a tight strike zone but Ali Kilponen was still able to be successful in the circle dominating with nine strikeouts allowing four hits and just one run and then Aliyah Andrews driving in the tying run and at the plate winning the freebie war as LSU calls it which ultimately led to the four to one win. That's one of the things that we're trying to do every game is win the freebie war. That's one of our you know things on the board that we're trying to do and they were able to take the I think that eight free passes tonight. So I think um, you know winning the freebie war definitely was the key to the whole thing tonight and it is a lot of nights. You know it's capitalizing on other people's mistakes and taking what you can. So they did a good job with that. It's just literally about who has the most guts. So like the third game this game it's just you know we didn't have that many hits but it's about like who is going to get on base, who's going to win the freebie war, who's going to find a way to score. So I think winning and fighting back for these last two games is definitely going to help us in the future. LSU now improving to 17 and 8 on the season and coming up take on South Alabama on the road Wednesday and then the Florida Gators in Gainesville for a three game series. For your Go Nation, I'm Brooke Kirchhofer.